Hello guys, this is 108 Anoop and today I'm gonna show you some iPad tips and tricks with the review. First, organization. How to move apps and delete apps. So first, we look for an app that we want to move. So basically we tap and hold the app and if we press the X over it, it will delete the app and if we want to move it, we just drag it and drop it next we have shortcuts and multitasking so let me open a web page now if I want to go to the top I can just tap on the uh, main bar and I am on the top of the web, web page this is the fastest way to the top now multitasking so if you want to multitask you just uh, minimize the app using the uh, home button and then you can open other apps now another thing we have the multitasking gestures You just have to uh, on them if they're off. It's right in the general section. Now, if you want to get back to the home, you have the four finger uh, pinch. So basically you do this and you get to the home. Also, if you, uh, if you swipe, up uh, on the upper side with four fingers you will have the task manager so you open one app and you can uh, rotate between the apps using four finger swipe uh, next we have some safari tips and tricks uh, so we just open up safari now if i have to find something on this page I can just tap over here and now I have find on page option. Now I can find anything on this page using this option. Now next thing is that if you have a web address say uh, gmail instead of dot com you have many other options dot in dot eu dot net dot edu dot ie dot com dot co dot uk dot org etc so th this might come handy a lot of times next we have the sharing links option you can just add to bookmark list add to home screen email it tweet or print next we have some keyboard tips and tricks so first of all we can uh, we open up notepad now if I tap and hold A I have many options the, these might be symbols from other languages etc and now we have uh, how to get the rupee symbol now if you would uh, go to the num numeric pad you would see that the currency symbol and tap and hold you don't see the rupee symbol over here to get the rupee symbol what you need to do is go to settings international region format and change this to united states go back now we open up notepad and now we have the rupee symbol unlocked next we have the emoticons to enable them you go to general then keyboard and then you uh, add another keyboard and select emoji 
what this does is that when you change your keyboard you tap this button to change keyboard you have hindi and then you have emoticons next we have the email settings now if you tap this button you can edit the signature so you can have your signature as anything this is how to edit the signature now we open up mail now if i want to delete a message i just swipe from left to right and i have the delete option next we have the battery percentage you can see that i have the battery percentage showing over here if you want to disable it or enable it you go to general usage and then you can just switch it off or on now we have the security passcode for that we have to go to uh, general then we go to passcode lock we can turn the passcode lock on also if you don't want to use the conventional or standard four uh, numeric digit passcode you can just turn off the simple passcode and then it will ask you for a for an alpha numeric or symbol password that would be more uh, security the uh, the security of that password would be higher next we have the picture frame now if i press the home button i have this option of picture frame i have a slide show of all my pictures and you can just put the ipad on your table and it is a nice view like your pictures are uh, randomizing and you can see the pictures this is a very easy method you can turn it off like this next we have some tips for the maps app we open up maps and there is a method to get uh, the digital compass yeah you just double tap on this arrow and it's loading now you have the compass so this is the compass north east west and south so this is an uh, this is uh, this comes very handy in a lot of situations now we have a method of taking a screenshot for that you need to press the uh, power button at the back and the home button at the same time this will take a screenshot which will be saved in your photos app um right here is our screenshot next we have the music control if we just double tap the home button that will bring up the task manager we can also do it by swiping four fingers to the top now if we slide to the left we have the music control options last i this is my first ios device so i was a little bit uh nervous about using it secondly i didn't know how to restart this device so to restart this device you just have to press the power button and the home button tap and hold and you have this option to slide to power off and to switch on you just press the home button uh, sorry the power button at the back that would just restart the device so that's it for today guys uh, thank you and have a nice day